Okay, this is a little tiny lap. Uh, I'm going to strip the pitch off this. I've got a little chisel. Uh, I put this in the freezer to freeze the pitch. And when you put it in the freezer like that, the pitch crumbles right off and it's really easy to clean them up. Get the Just that easy to clean a pitch lid. Ready for another coating. Okay, today I'm recovering pitch from some old pitch laps. Uh, the pitch on these, the trick to this is to freeze them. I put these little pitch laps in the freezer, let them freeze for a couple hours until they're good and solid, then I just use a standard woodworking uh, chisel to take the pitch off. <laughs> so you, once they're frozen, the pitch just comes right off. Pitch gets, pitch gets really brittle once it's frozen. If you try to do this when the pitch is at room temperature, uh, it's a little more difficult to get it off. But once it's frozen, life is easy. So there's the first little pitch lap, all clean. And there's the second tiny little guy. I recover all the pitch from the old pitch laps and then remelt it. And uh, you can see how much pitch that I recovered off the bunch of laps that I did today, pitch, and I just collected it up on a newspaper and then put it in an aluminum foil uh, container here to uh, store it. Then when you melt it, it might have some contaminants in it. It might have a little bit of, uh, of plaster from the, the base or it might have some dust or dirt on it. Basically when you melt it, uh, you'll get two kinds of contaminants. Some stuff will float on the top and some stuff will sink to the bottom. So what I do is I melt it, I skim off what floats on the top, pour the melt into another uh, pan, and pretty much all the contaminants are left in the scum in the bottom. So that's how I recover all the pitch. Uh, it does lose some of the volatiles as you use it, so I usually use a little bit of linseed oil. Maybe uh, in, a, in a pot this big I might use a teaspoon of linseed oil to put a little bit of volatiles back in there. But that's how I recover the pitch.